as I've been out on the campaign trail, one of the biggest concerns and one of the biggest issues that I've spoken the most about is jobs and economic development. One of the best things that I think that we can do for our businesses and our economic development is to shop locally and spend our money here in our county and support our businesses. So what I'd like to do today is to take you on a little tour of some of my favorite spots in District 1 in Arapahoe County. One of my favorite places to spice up my cooking at home is right here on Main Street in Littleton. It's the Savory Spice Shop, and I wish you could smell on this video, but unfortunately you can't. But we're gonna go in and sample some of the spices. A great place to eat while you're here in downtown Littleton is to stop by Merle's. Lots of times my family and I come down and go to the Littleton Town Arts Center, see a show, and then come down to Merle's and grab a bite to eat. If you like chicken salads, their Thai chicken salad is the best. One of my favorite shops is the Knitted Piece. I learned how to knit here. I've learned how to use different yarns, and I continue to have a lot of fun coming to their classes and using and supporting this local business. If you want some really beautiful and unique flower arrangements, come down on South Broadway to Bannister Flowers. Go in and say hi to Rosie and Josh and the family in here in Bannisters. Rosie and her brother Josh. Ray. Ray. Are, are working lots of um, lots of hours to give us these beautiful arrangements. So hi, Josh. Hi there. How's it going? Tell us a little bit about your shop here. Uh, we've been in business about 18 years. We actually bought it from the Bannisters. Uh, I think it was 17, 18 years ago. My sister and my mom are just incredible designers. They do all variety of arrangements. Just use high-end flowers, cutting-edge designs. So they really, really proud do. of their work. So. It's very unique. It's not like any other florist shop I've ever been in. Anyone who's ever lived in or been a part of Arapahoe County knows where A&A &A Trading Post is. As a matter of fact, when my husband and I were first married, we lived very close to here, and that was my Saturday day, going back and forth to A&A &A Trading Post to pick up all of our supplies. If you're looking for a good cup of coffee and some pastries, Blueberries is your place. It's here in the Woodlawn Shopping Center in Littleton. And if you're looking for lunch, I can attest for the greatness of their portobello mushroom wrap. I think I'm gonna go in and grab a quick drink. If you're looking for a unique gift to get for someone, come to my favorite pottery shop. This is the Polish Pottery Outlet, and they're right at Santa Fe and Oxford. It's a brothers, two brothers that started this business and one of the brothers actually goes over to Poland and purchases the pottery himself and brings it back. You will love this family-run business and you get to meet everybody down to the dog. Magnum, the dog, is a Katrina survivor and one of the brothers has a one-year-old son, Liam, and he is cute. If you have some need for great framing, this is the place to be. Frame to Art has been in the Inglewood, Denver area for over 20 years. And they see clients, everyone from the Broncos to the Nuggets, to Colorado University, to regular old folks like us. So let's go on in and meet Brian and he treats you just like he does those famous folks that come in. So we just came inside this beautiful store, Frame to Art, and I wanted to introduce you to the owner, Brian. Hi, Carrie. Hi, thanks for letting us come in. Yeah, thanks for coming. Tell me a little bit about your shop. I know it's a really unique place and, and kind of unique in some of the things that you do here. We have a lot of fun here. Uh, this next March will be 22 years in business. We frame for all four sports teams, uh, a lot of the colleges around here. We're framing 16 jerseys right now for CU. Uh, we do a lot of uh, charity events in town. It's always been important to us since day one to get involved and help out the community. Uh, we have a lot of unusual things we frame. We frame guitars, we frame um, jerseys uh, for a lot of events around town. Uh, we always have something different here every day to frame. Ever since I've been open, I've always felt it important to get involved with the community. The more people you meet, the more people who possibly come into the store. Um, plus, we're here every day. We want to make the community help it better. Uh, to get business for all of us, not just one business. 
Um, so involved with the uh, business improvement district for Inglewood here in the chamber. Uh, but uh, South Broadway Mile, we're from Yale to Hampton, and we have about 120 businesses wow. along Broadway. Uh, and we've seen a lot of neat improvements the last five or six years. Yes. As a matter of fact, we are going to go have lunch, Brian, and we're going to hit some of the restaurants, some of my favorite awesome. places, Tepe Juan and Saigon yeah. Palace down the street. They're so good. Now, if you do come to the Saigon Palace, be sure to walk around the corner and ring the <laughs> for good luck. Well, I grew up here in Inglewood, and one of my favorite places to go for great Mexican food is El Tepiwan here. Now, we've shared with you a lot of my favorite places to go in Arapahoe County, and we'd love for you to share your ideas with us of your favorite places. Now I'm going to go have some lunch.